In my previous two videos, I showed I built the world's fastest Hackintosh build ever, based on AMD Ryzen Threadripper 3970X. So Monster 32 core, 64 threads, macOS Catalina Ryzen Tosh. But despite people could see it on their own eyes, they still refused to believe it. People wrote me really a lot of comments, mostly very nice, and I always try to answer to all of them. But insane amount of them was asking about the same thing, if it can run Adobe applications. So after I answered to a lot of those, I refused to answer the same questions again and again, just because people are lazy to read comments. So instead of shooting building video, I decided to prove you again in front of your eyes that this Ryzen Tosh, the AMD 3970X Ultimate Hackintosh in 2020 can run any Adobe application. But first, if you are new here, my name is Teresa from Morgonaut Cloud and I built Hackintoshes since macOS 10.4 version, so it's already more than 15 years. I have all you need for how to build a Hackintosh in my videos already on my YouTube channel, so check them out. I also provide personal individual support with Apple Mac, Windows, Linux and server builds. So if you would need any help, just join my website membership. Link is in this video description and I will help you while Skype video call and remote session directly to your computer in front of your eyes. Make sure you click the subscribe button below, hit the bell next to it and choose all notifications so you won't miss any of my future videos. For the purpose of this video, as you can see I have inside only single GPU, the Radeon 5700 XT, so all other three PCI Express slots are empty. And to prove you fact, these two displays are really connected to this 5700 XT inside of this 3970X Hackintosh, I will now disconnect each display cable and reconnect back. That was the first one, come on, that was not, yeah, and now the second one, come on, yeah, and now the second one, so, come on, yeah, there's no reason to show you all 50 plus Adobe applications, that would be very long video. Simply when I can run one, I can run any. So I will show you the most common ones. I will start, let's say, with with latest Photoshop. Photoshop 2020. Okay, so let's open some picture, I don't know, some random screenshot, yeah, so this is my last results, you know, pen tool, blah, 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 as you can see, performance is perfectly fine. What you would be interested in is here, the performance, as you can see, detected graphics processor, AMD Radio 5700 XT, use graphic processor, so the GPU is perfectly working, so... What about next? You know, Photoshop. Okay, Photoshop is done. People ask me about Lightroom, so here you have Lightroom. Again, Lightroom, latest one, 2020 CC. So, let's import, you know, I don't use Lightroom, but it's only for you now. Let's see, users, what we have. Okay, check all. Where is the import button? Here, let's import it. Importing files. Two operations in progress. Okay. You know, really, I don't don't use Lightroom. Uh, but as you can see, it's perfectly working. So, let's move to another application. Yes, I want to quit. People ask me, of course, about Adobe Premiere because they say it's the best application on planet. If they believe it, okay. So I moved one of my older projects here. It's this one. Yeah. So as you can see, 
it's working so i will show you again the where is it the per yeah no it's in projects project settings general as you can see it's using the mercury playback engine gpu accelerator metal so it's fully utilizing the amd 5700 xt i can even now let it run this way you know i can now show you some quick export why i cannot export it yeah export media adobe stock progress 444 okay export exporting so as you can see here it's showing 64 threads no real mac has 64 threads only ryzen amd threadripper 3970x 32 core 64 threads cpu 5700 xt is utilized you know cpu is quite quite not doing anything when i will look at the utilization yeah cpu is idling at 91 percent so quite nothing i will let it run in the background so as you could see i can run any adobe applications without single problem but as you could see in my doc I have here also all major video editing applications, Adobe Premiere Pro, Final Cut Pro and DaVinci Resolve. So I'm working on a huge comparison video of performance of each of those apps on this Ryzen Tosh in the latest macOS Catalina. And by the way, yes, I made on this AMD Hackintosh build also test of performance in Logic Pro 10 and it's really mind blowing, it's huge. So make sure to click the subscribe button below, hit the bell next to it and choose all notifications so you won't miss any of my future videos. And if you would need any help with Apple Mac, Windows, Linux or server build, you can get my personal individual support, Skype video call and remote session directly to your computer in front of your eyes. Just join my website membership on morgonout.cloud or patreon.com slash morgonout. So, as you could see, I have no problem to run any Adobe application on my AMD Ryzen Threadripper 3970X, the 32-core Hackintosh on TRX40 platform, no matter what haters in Hackintosh forums say. So, I hope I made your day again a little better. If so, please click on the like button below and share this video so it can help to more people. So, that's all for today. See you next time, my Hackintosh friends.